Well, I am the warning preparedness meteorologist specifically for Saskatchewan. There were a total of 163 records broken, so 97 maximum temperature records, so daily highs, and 66 minimum temperature records, meaning the overnight lows were very, very high. Well, what's important when we talk about records is that you have a consistent number of observations from a place. So we've had observations, you know, near the airport since about 1900. You know, it's just a lot of equipment uh, with plugs in it and stuff like that. And it's very specialized and it's very expensive. The standard height is the two meters because that's mostly where most people live. It, it, the station has to be to those standards and it has to be ventilated and um, shaded. Now everything's pretty much automated. Um, so uh, it, a lot of it's instant because the temperature is actually read minute, minute by minute. You know, since 1937, that record held. And then three days in a row, it was broken. Uh, we now have a new temperature record that's almost five degrees warmer. And that's scary. Like, it's interesting, but it's scary. Like, that's when you look at sort of how maximum and minimum temperatures go and how the records go, you know, this, this, this noise. And the, that temperature reading went whoop, like wh way above way above anything that we've ever seen before. You know, then we see the, the forest burning down, then we see people evacuating, then we see the air quality decrease, then we see the farmers struggling with their crops. You know, that, that's the story, what's happening now and what are, what are these records telling us? 